Now this is a new addition as well. This is the Black Adam. He actually looks good. I like the black tones um, compared to the Shazam. Uh, this one, uh, I do like this one better as the, though. I, I, like I said, uh, I think it, I like more the black tones with the uh, with the rocks here and everything. That one I really love. Look at that. Let me try to focus in the face. There you go. Very nicely done. I like the expression as well. So this is the base close up for the Black Adam 1-6 scale. It has a very good Egyptian writing there or something. I'm not really sure <laughs> it's Egyptian. But I do like the, the details in that one. And how it's like, like ruins and everything. And I'm not sure who this uh, Egyptian god though. Maybe, I don't know, Egyptian god of death or something. Or maybe um, thunder or I'm not sure. But it is really good um, detail here or let's say addition. Like I said, I like the yellowish or brown like ruins and the black. I think it works for me regarding the color scheme for this one. So this is Black Adam uh, XM Studios 1.6 scale. So this is something new. This is actually Catwoman. And I this is the first time I've seen her. The 1.6 scale version. So you can see she actually looks quite gorgeous. Very interesting face though. Look at that. Very nicely done. I do like those um, small, let's say, bag. I mean her bag is there and some cat. This small additions uh, in the base makes it really interesting. I like that. And I do feel I love how they they made the the whip go around her that is actually very nice I like that one as well it makes this this piece even though she's just crouching there it makes the piece more dynamic because of this rope or this whip so a bit detail on the on the base so there you go look at this one and look at the bag there's some details there I hope I can I can make it focus though look at that there's some details there and look at the cat very nice detail of this one and this is how she looks like I do hope there's still some switch out for her because she just looks quite stunning so this is XM Studios Catwoman 1-6 scale so it was just yesterday or last night that I found out how um, Greg Capolo created or designed uh, the Red Death. So he said that the, he needs to showcase something that resembles like fast. And as you can see the details here of, the, uh, of his suit. So according to him this was actually based on like thinking like a race car. So it has some spoilers and everything. So it's actually like that uh, because of that concept of something fast so it resembles like a, like a race car. And this one is beautifully done. It's not overly done though, I like it. Um, so it has some bats and everything so for most of you who has, um, how would say, not read the um, DC Metal or Batman Metal. So this is actually a Batman version of Flash in a bad way so this is red death from xm studios so the red death base this resembles as the batman um batmobile so as you can see i guess this is the batmobile and you can see there's a tons of detail there there's some bats it's actually quite a very good diorama around him so that is actually quite good uh, it gives him a very good look though look at that one so if done in a very nice how would say angle and very nice lighting this would definitely look good look at that I do wish if there is something like a um, like a flash or something but it does look good because this 
this piece has very nice like like lightning slash bat um, bat symbols so that actually looks very good 